Hello, I'm Joe, a technical engineer with Threatscape's global award-winning Microsoft security practice. And today we're going to take a look at Microsoft Defender for Cloud Apps, and more specifically app connectors, and how they can help you bring control and visibility into the cloud apps which your organization are using. So let's take a look inside the Defender for Cloud App portal. And if we toggle to settings and then go to app connectors underneath sources, we can have a look at the applications which we're already connected to. And you can see that we're connected to Microsoft 365, Microsoft Azure, and we've disabled Dropbox Contoso and Dropbox Company isn't currently connected. So let's take a look inside Microsoft 365 and have a look at this visibility that we get. If we look at the dashboards, you get a quick overview of active users and the activity that go, is going on in your Microsoft 365 application. Quickly, we'll go to accounts. So you can see the visibility which you can get into the accounts that your organization has on Office 365 and any other cloud apps which are connected. You can also see that you have the ability to see which groups users are. So in this case, you can see Isaiah is a Microsoft 365 administrator. You can also see if there's any OAuth apps which are using profiles um, from Microsoft 365. As you can see, none are currently being used. And there's also an activity log. So you can see any activities which are going on in your applications. And then we can create policies based on these activities that you see, which will come up in the alert sections. And you can see, thankfully, we have no alerts. We'll take a look now at what an alert looks like. And so now we are in the alert section or Defender for Cloud Apps. And you can see we have got a load of alerts which I have generated. And they are from different applications or web applications. We've got one from Dropbox Contoso here, one from Microsoft Azure, Defender for Cloud Apps, and Microsoft 365. So you can see we've got one pane where we can see security alerts for all of our web applications or for these four at least. And as you can see, we get sign-in policies. When they are breached across any web application, you are alerted in here. So logins from risky IP addresses and impossible travel activity. You also get alerts on risky OAuth applications, which may be using user profiles within, in this case, Microsoft, Microsoft 365 in a manner which we don't want them to, or giving them permissions which is above our company policy. You can see we also have sign-in policies for password spray if a user is inputting too many incorrect passwords, as well as Dropbox and Microsoft 365 file sharing policies. So we can have one file sharing policy which we can unify across applications like Dropbox and OneDrive. So that concludes our quick look into app connectors. Be sure to like and subscribe um, so you don't miss out on any new content. And thanks for watching.